Hello people, this is Sam. Um, sorry for the video quality and the sound quality. Um, I kind of sound like a little girl on this video. I don't in real life. Um, I'm using my phone. Um, today I need help with a little problem. Um, uh, my iPod Touch, second generation, 8 gigabyte, will not sync. Um, I am using, uh, my computer is Windows XP, Professional Service Pack 3. Uh, let me get that the properties up for you. Um, sorry, I have a Mac theme, so people might have thought I had a Mac at first, but Windows XP Professional version 2002, Service Pack 3. And I do not have a Mac. This is Windows. I'm not running an emulation or anything. This is a real Windows. So, um, yeah. So, uh, here's what happens. Is I, t I open iTunes, um, and I'm going to plug my uh, second generation iPod Touch in. And what it does is, up at the top where that little Apple is, it'll show a little bar that says syncing iPod. Um, and right there where the iPod name would be, it will not, the little circle will not move, or sometimes it does, but it doesn't do anything. Um, let's uh, plug the iPod in. So, let's see what happens. Um, this one, that's not what usually happens, but, let's, uh, reconnect these, uh, let's reconnect my iPod Touch. It thinks it's an iPhone, I have a theme on it. I have a theme on my computer, I'm quite the hacker. See, it thinks, it thinks it's an iPhone, it even has AT&T, 3G, um, let's see. Connect to the items again and see what happens. Oh, it is not connected as of right now. So let's uh, try something. Okay. Go into the back of my computer and I'm going to pull it out. Plug it back in. No. It, okay, iCloud cannot read the contents of. Let's yeah, go to the summary tab and iPod preferences and click restore to this iPod to iPod factory settings. Well, right now it's telling me this. This morning it told me it just started syncing like that. Okay, now okay, there's a little. There's my iPod. I don't want you to. Okay, okay let's um. So let's uh. It says syncing, see, it's not moving, and it just says syncing Sam's iPod Touch. That is moving, if you guys can't see it. Um, that is not. Let's actually eject this iPod right now. Um, yeah. Like to eject the iPod at this second. And I'll plug it back in, because I don't want those two things there. Um, I'm using USB 2.0. There's my iPod. Oh, it just disconnected. Something reconnected. It does this all the time. Right now, it doesn't want to show up in iTunes. I don't know why it does that all the time. Um, after eject, it doesn't want to show back up in iTunes. So, that's basically it. Um, sorry. Um, that's basically all that happens. Um, okay, it's, it's reconnecting. Let it connect real fast. Um,
it just disconnected and reconnected again. Right now it is connected, connected to, and it's uh, syncing in progress. I have tried restoring it, and all it does is says n cannot restore iPod due to error. Blah 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 blah. Um, it won't work. Um. Can anybody please help me? I'd be really grateful. Um, uh, please help me. Thank you. Bye. Oh, wait. <laughs> um, one other thing before I go. Um, if anybody knows how to get a uh, Mac OS X um, on your PC without a torrent file, um, I've tried it once and it didn't work. Uh, I don't like the theme that much. So if anybody knows how to get the actual Mac OS X on your computer without having to pay for it and without having, uh, without having a torrent, please, uh, message, message me. Thank you, uh, rate, comment, and subscribe. Peace out.